Dallas, Quinn Ewers finally got a chance to play in his first Red River showdown, and he made the most of it, leading Texas to a historic 49-0 win over Oklahoma on Saturday. After getting the starting nod late this week following recovery from a clavicle injury suffered in Week 2 against Alabama, Ewers threw for a career-high 289 yards, completing 21 of 31 passes for four touchdowns and one interception. The redshirt freshman from South Lake Carroll, who played high school football about 30 miles from the Cotton Bowl, said it was a dream to play in this game. I know all these guys were pretty excited, but growing up a fan, I always wanted to play in this one, Ewers said. So it's pretty special. Ewers' demeanor in the raucous environment of the rivalry game in the middle of the State Fair of Texas impressed his teammates. His poise in any situation is unmatched, said Jordan Whittington, who caught five passes for 97 yards. He just looks calm, relaxed the whole time. If you went to war with somebody and you look at him and has freaking out, you'd probably freak out. You got Quinn in a war with you, you're just chilling. So we'd be relaxed, too. Texas coach Steve Sarkeesian said he didn't decide on who would be the starter until late in the week after both Hudson Card and Ewers, who had been struggling with injuries, looked healthier than they had been in weeks. I know everyone thinks this was the plan all along or something, Sarkeesian said. I didn't notify Quinn or Hud of what was going to happen this week, literally, until Thursday afternoon. But he said both quarterbacks were ready, and he was happy about how Ewers performed. Quinn was spot on, Sarkeesian said. The ball was going where it was supposed to go, on time. And the playmakers made their plays. In the end, he was ready, and that's why we did what we did. 